I came across uh, this great plugin for WordPress where you can customize the admin bar that's right at the top of the theme. Uh, I got it from this site where she exp uh, made it for us all to use and I thought I would make a video on how to upload it and customize the colors of the plugin. To do that you need to download the plugin from here because it's not available on the WordPress uh, repository yet. So you need to download it from here and then install it on your WordPress. Uh, I have already downloaded it so I'm going to install that plugin on this test site that I have and this is what we're going to change this black bar at the top. Uh, click on plugin and then add new and search for that upload and search for the file that where we downloaded that zip file and I normally always download it on my G drive and WordPress plugins folder and look for that body press sliding login panel this is a one and click on open and there it is and click on install uh, activate the plugin and as per her instructions on this site uh, we need to make a couple of changes on our files to get it working. Uh, the first one is this one down here. So if we copy this and put it in our header file on your theme header file. Uh, go back into your admin and go on appearance and editor and as for instructions, he wants us to change it in our header file. In our header PHP file, we paste that code right underneath this body tag that she's got on the instructions. So copy, paste and then save this file and then the other change she needs to us to do is this one down here we need to disable the admin bar that's right at the top of the theme so we copy this and to do that you need to log into cPanel uh, your hosting app. To do that you need to log into your cPanel and then click on uh, Legacy File Manager click OK uh, I'm working on my test site I have another WordPress that's installed on my root and I'm have a test site that I work on to make videos and click on config PHP file and then edit file edit and uh, this is the configuration file I would 
don't make any other changes but log to the bottom of the file and then just paste that code right there and then save the file mm, I can close this one I can close this one now that I have made those changes uh, we should be able to see the file changed there it is I've got log out and then my account and my account as you can see you'll have all your uh, on the next video I'm going to show you how to change these colors if you want uh, to match match your theme. Thank you.